Black holes were first theorized in 1783 by John Michel, who proposed dark stars with gravity so strong that light couldn't escape. Pierre-Simon Laplace suggested a similar idea in 1796. In 1915, Einstein's general relativity described how mass curves space-time. Carl Schwarzschild, 1916, found a solution predicting regions where gravity traps everything. In the 1930s, Chandrasekhar and Oppenheimer studied stellar collapse, showing massive stars could form such objects. John Wheeler coined black hole in 1967. Observational proof came in 1971. Cygnus X1, 2015, gravitational waves from black hole mergers, and 2019, Event Horizon Telescope's first black hole image. Einstein's general relativity, 1915, allowed for black holes, but he doubted their existence. In 1916, Carl Schwarzschild found a solution describing them, but Einstein saw it as a mathematical oddity. In 1939, he published a paper arguing that nature would prevent black hole formation. That same year, Oppenheimer and Snyder showed collapsing stars could form black holes, but their work was ignored. Einstein believed the universe was stable and disliked singularities. By the 1960s, Penrose, Wheeler and Hawking proved black holes were real. Ironically, black holes became one of the strongest confirmations of Einstein's own theory.